guys, Chloe here. Today's workout is a kettlebell complex. So one kettlebell and three exercises. We've got a kettlebell clean followed by a goblet squat and we're going to finish off with a kettlebell um, swing. Okay, so let me show you what the exercises look like and then we'll chat about how you're going to set it up for yourself. Okay, so starting with our clean, you're going to be standing right over top of the kettlebell. Two hands wrapping up and warm. Snap that weight up to your chest, and then we're going to bring it all the way down, okay? So make sure you bend the knees, snatching that weight up to the chest, tucking those elbows in at the top, okay? Once you're finished with the kettlebell clean, we're going to move into a goblet squat, so holding in that clean position for the wrapped kettlebell position, you're going to move into a goblet squat. Okay. Keeping that kettlebell nice and close to the body. Once we're finished with the squats, we're going to move right into a swing. Okay? So with our swing, squeezing the glutes, driving those hips forward, and just coming up until those hips are locked out, making sure we're not overextending into our low back. We're keeping our core nice and tight, our back should be flat. And the kettlebell, or the arms are extending out in front of you, somewhere between waist and uh, shoulder height. So, how it's going to work is you're going to set a timer for 10 minutes. You're going to perform 10 goblet clean or kettlebell clean, 12 goblet squat, 15 kettlebell swings. You're going to try and get through as many rounds as possible in that 10 minute period. So you're going to have to listen to your body and know where you need to take rest, ideally. Try and perform all three exercises before you take a break. Um, but if, of course, you need to take breaks in between exercises because your form's getting a little bit sloppy, you're fatigued, and you're just feeling like you're going to hurt yourself by muscling through the repetitions, then definitely take a break, okay? But ideally, we're keeping that intensity high, working as hard as we can for 10 minutes to get through as many rounds of all three exercises as we can, okay? so. Let me know how you do, have fun, and get sweaty.